What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy. We're right, right back at it. Continuing where we left off in Chapter 4. Just ran into Juniper, who's a new hero. I'm gonna try to do her quest and uh, get her to join me, because that's how I'm gonna get the ability to ride on wires. No, you know how folks are when their flame clock runs low. They'll come on us like starved beasts. Yeah, I know. But I can't just turn a blind eye. Very eager to uh, get her recruited. Something so valuable here. Judging by how the tracks stop here, it seems that this is where those soldiers pass through. Through here? But how? Hmm. Doesn't look easily traversable, does it? Yeah, I can't see us getting across there anytime soon. We could always take a detour. Look, this way. Yeah. Thanks, Tyon. Like I said, we can't afford to be hanging around here. Come on, we haven't got all day. Nimble little so and so sliding down here on a rope. I wonder if they could teach me to do that. Oh, that's a rare one. I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. Someone's needy. You're a lifesaver. You're unstoppable with you around, Senna. <laughs> one of those I'm rare the girl with the gall. Don't try to stop us. We can do it. No doubt about it. Huh, no, no, no. Someone's needed. Right. Uh, uh, butterfly flame. Moon. Cross. You never know what you can need. Don't try to stop us. Never a dull moment, eh? No more No love for someone's need. You're a lifesaver. Documenting every chest I have. I don't know why. I'm never gonna write a guide about where they are, but at this point, I'm too committed to stop. Huh. Incredible. I, I feel the energy of the trees. And they're for honest, like buried in these ruins. This is crazy. There was a colony here. That's right. This is an abandoned colony. Please listen to us. We didn't come here to fight you. Mm. We can free you from your flame clock. Free us? You don't have much time left on yours, do you? We can help you with that, so if you just... Stop attacking you? Yeah. Mm. All right. I'll hear you out. Uh... Thank you. Please, come in. They're still wary of us. Can't let our guard down. Good to add more names. Colony Tau. Save it real quick. It's good to keep a record. More colonies added. 
Not a lot of people around. One thing I must do before I forget. Hold the phone. Not a I've lot leveled up all my Ouroboros now, which I was neglecting yeah. to do for way too long. It's quite unlike any other colony. Let me take the crops. Uh, even though they're supposed to be poor and starving, they have crops. Even for a place this tumble down, the people here seem so resigned. I've seen a few colonies with dwindling flame clocks before, but this one is especially bizarre. It's like they're not trying to survive here at all. Do you get that impression? Back when I was stationed at Lambda, I'd heard rumors about Colony Tau. What did they say? That deep in the forest, there's a colony with some very peculiar customs and traditions. This is my first time seeing it in reality, but I never expected it to be so run down. Did you have any dealings with it? None at all. This is just hearsay from Commander Izzard. Anyway, we should hurry. Let's smash the flame clock and free everyone. It being an abandoned colony, we are continually starved of sufficient life sources. Wait, are you the commander? That's right. Sorry, I failed to tell you before. I am Juniper, and it's my job to lead Colony Tau. If that's so, then surely you must know who we are. I'm afraid I know nothing. Huh? We have no need of such information. Juniper told us we'd welcome you in, whoever you might turn out to be. So, that's the rule. We don't ask questions. But you attacked us back there. Our scouts told us about some monsters in the forest they've never seen before. So, we sent them out on a hunt. But then they bumped into you en route. They must have figured it would be more efficient to get you out of the way first. Though, so, contrary to our plan, we were made to retreat. Oh yeah? What about your consul? Where are they hiding? I told you, this is an abandoned colony. Our consul really visits us. You're in such a strange situation. All the more reason to get you out of this predicament. I think you guys are getting the wrong end of the stick here. <sighs> it's true. We aren't afraid of Colony Tau's flame clock running out. All it means is the end of our days gazing at our ever-diminishing supply. But you could die! Uh-huh. As if we just let you waltz in and break our flame clock. We all have to perish someday. If our lives should expire, then we'll sink into silence, darkness, oblivion. We'll return to the Earth. <sighs> yes, but... you can't just... The land will take us, and we will simply be. And That's how colony it is a colony is morbid. Tower. No one will ever think of us. And yet here we are. Slowly but surely, we are withering. We don't always find the nutrition that we need to live. If Colony Tau cannot accumulate the vital flames it needs, then it proves only that we were too weak. And in nature, the weak are destined to perish. The logic would dictate that nature is pushing you to become stronger. If we set you free, you won't have to worry about all this crap. We neither worry nor fear for what may come to pass. We've already lost so many of our friends and allies. And every time we return to their bodies to the Earth, such will be our fate. What's the point of fearing the inevitable? We know we're gonna die. What's wrong with us living the way we always have? But how do you live without hope? It will spell the end of the story that our predecessors weaved for generations. A tale cut short. I would argue that it feels a little melancholy. In that sense, if we were to be freed from the flame clock, then... Juniper! Bad news! Tell me. The monsters are coming straight for the colony, and they already took one of us down. No. They came all the way here. 
We'll join you. Yo, let's Good to go. have more names. Hold up, let me grab some of this stuff real quick. I need some of that monster mango. It's my new favorite flavor. Oh, I'm so sorry. I will help you in a minute, but I just found all this parkour. I need to do it. So I'll get to helping y'all in a minute. There's got to be something up here. It's always my favorite thing in every Zeno game, whenever you get to the ruined city, like, area, and you're platforming around and what is, like, factories and warehouses for us here. I hope we can make use of this. This thing gonna let me go. I think you operate it like so. Okay. Of course. Man, they're really putting this ability in your face, huh? You know, I can't do it yet. <gasps> See if I can jump to the objective. Oh, I didn't jump. I'm gonna fall into the cutscene. Not like this. Never mind. <laughs> Let me see if we can get the elevator working. That'd be nice. Better give it a good one, over. This little abandoned colony just distracted me. Crazy. Wonder what's inside. Keep on trucking and trucking. <sighs> Get 
Liam's okay. He's still alive. Thank the flames. I'm so glad we made it in time. I'm so glad. Again, accept my thanks. We Don't worry about it. <sighs> I suppose it's strange of me to talk about the laws of nature when I fear losing my friends. Not at all. Honestly, that seems like the most natural thing of all. When you told me that you would release us from the flame clot, I thought that if you really were telling the truth, it would make life easier. But at the same time, I began to hate the fact that I was looking for a way out. Looking up at our clock, seeing the life ebbing away, I'd already accepted my fate. And letting go of that status quo, wretched though it was, after so long, I was scared of what might happen if we did. Juniper. Noah, your words at the time seemed so appealing to me. I could not destroy the collective efforts that became the colony and everything it represents with my own two hands. But then you said you would destroy it for us. We'd be guilt-free. If that isn't appealing, then what is? You must have been aware of how tragic it is to simply await death. That's why you invited us, isn't it? Even now, I'm not afraid of dying. But I hated the idea of losing those I hold dear. When I saw my friend lying there, I remembered what you told me, and for a brief moment, I felt the grip of fear. I felt so weak and helpless, yet at the same time, I didn't want to let go of my dear friend. So I must have closed myself off. I stopped thinking closed my eyes and covered my ears. Perhaps I was simply waiting for the inevitable release. Even so, we have to keep thinking. That's right. Even if there are things we'd rather not see, we still need to look. And breaking out of your shell, scrambling in desperation for a way to escape despair. That's not what I call being weak. You've defended this place for so long. Why? Because you're strong. And once you're no longer shackled by the rules of the flame clock, you can accept a different reality. You can become stronger still. I know it. You can. You can. It won't be easy. Far from it. But we'll help you. Juniper, it's your call. We've made it this far thanks to you. Yes, I suppose so. If... There is a possibility that you can release us from the clock, then please. And if not, it's not like anything's changed. <laughs> Very true. If you can't break it, I can live with that too. Nothing changes without a reason, without a cause. Perhaps this event will teach me to see things in a new light. Here we go! Oh yeah. <laughs> I see acceptance is actually surprisingly easy when it comes down to it. I think it probably is, yeah. Uh, I'm sorry if this seems rude, but could I ask another favor of you? Sure. I'd like to learn much more of the world, become a stronger individual. To that end, is there any chance I could accompany you? What do you say, guys? We could certainly do with someone of Juniper's caliber. It'd be reassuring to have you on board. You're very welcome to join. Is your colony going to be okay, though? Can they get on without you? Colony Tower needs to undergo change, too. We need to extend our knowledge and grow. So I'd like you to take me on a trip, somewhere far away, and show me something new. A journey of discovery, huh? I guess that's another thing we need in order to grow. Might be an idea to send some of our younger recruits out, too. Could be a good lesson. It's time to breathe new life into our colony. Let us break free from the chains that once bound us. I guess I'm still hanging about, though. Can't have us all gallivanting about the place. 
Your console really doesn't bother to show up, huh? Even after we broke the flame clock? You think they'd know? Better this way, if you ask me. Still, we shouldn't rule out the possibility that they'll make trouble for you. If something happens, you tell us immediately, okay? Sure, can do. We'll be counting on you. Well, we don't have all day. I think it's about time we made tracks, no? You're right. Time to move, then. Well, then, everyone? Ah, don't worry about us. You know we can handle ourselves. We'll prove that Colony Tau can be so much more. Yes, I'm sure it will be. Off you go, then. Skedaddle. The colony's staying right here, waiting for your return. Yo, know, he's a little too eager to get rid of her. I'm saying. Alright, okay, Juniper is... Ah, oh, I got a rope slide. Let's go. It's a pleasure. Hey, Noah got a new class. Let's go. Time. Managing aggro. Works for allies with these arts. Follow up fields. Wait, what? Wait, what? You can cancel arts into other arts without using fusion arts. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh, that's huge! My stomach's growling. That is a huge turn of events. Good to add more names. What to buy? Always buy something so that they get affinity. Damn, there you go. Always buy something. Pro tip, pro tip, pro tip. Oh, my Zen, my Zeno nuts. My Z, my Z, my Zans. I see some relations have changed. Good intel. Are you left already? Anyway, he left already and somehow got hurt. Is she in the party? She is in the party. Let's fucking go, baby. Alright, she's a rest stop. I got a lot of stuff to talk about here. Anyone else want to talk before we... Oh, okay. Let's rest up, run the recipe, and... Oh, Better make sure we're well quick. rested. <clears throat> I'll start, shall I? Can't wait to see how Manana prepares it. These are all quests. I think we need to discuss this. She has a loyalty quest with the other heroes. I love that. This all requires her, I actually. I think we need to this discuss this. Interesting. Just triple hero quest?
Cool, getting a lot of quests. I think we need to discuss this. Interesting that this colony that is living in what looks like the ruins of old earth bury their dead and grow their own plant. Very fascinating. Are we all ready to fight? Spongy spuds. Damn, we're fast. I see some relations have changed. Give me lettuce. Oh, 
sure what's going on right now, but we're getting rocked. Not cool. You know, attack anybody or you're in for it now. Get out as much as I can. I know the move called Big Bang and Close Me. That's great final flash energy right there. Stones for emergencies. I hope nothing bad's happened. I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's go check. Some relations have changed. Good to add more names. Can we 
get a bite to eat, please? Let's make the most of our break, guys. Another side quest? Could you all come around for a second? I need to find a rest spot that I can bank this bonus. All right, let's SPS. get going. Time's a wasted. We have multiple side quests all taking place there. Interesting. Let's climb up and then use that rope. What I need before. You'll do just fine, Juniper. Let's go. Let me check. <laughs> yeah. Something up here. Yep, sure is. Oh, this location is awesome. Oh. It's awesome, right? It's gonna huh. get me fucked. Killed is what it's gonna do. Okay, let's see, if, into it or else. Let's, let's see if I can is make it by everyone and get the chest. Gotta believe, y'all. What I'm saying is, gotta believe. Send them off. Do they think I'd make it up here if I proved them wrong? Right here, go ahead, baby. Things. I'm gonna try. Huh. Don't want to fight me if I can make it by everything and get a landmark up here. Even though I'm definitely not supposed to be up here yet, that would be really awesome. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Huh. No one hit me. Good thing you found this. Please. Sense of exploration and then a late game is uh, unlike anything else, honestly. Gotta be a landmark around here so I can just teleport back. Gotta be, just gotta be. Trying to just dodge. <laughs> well, this just made my day. Let's fucking go, baby. I knew there'd be, I knew there'd be one. It's beautiful, this place, though. Look at that. Crazy location. Oh, think we found this. All this skyrimming it, my friends. Oh, this place has a hell of a view. I hope we can make use of this. Better be some super rare shit. Here's the real question, can I sneak back without getting killed? That was... That's what's up. It's on like level 54, 55? This would be a good place to like, power level though. 
you get like a spot that's like nine, ten levels above you. The amount of XP and class XP you get is like exponential to the roof. This is something decent, right? Compared to fighting stuff below or at your level. Those who do not know, Xenoblade will scale you down in terms of the XP and class points you're getting. The lower an enemy is from your level. So even if the enemy at your current level, let's say I fight a level 40 enemy at level 40, I'll get their normal, uh, I'll get their normal worth in terms of, um, Experience. Getting dark already. Smart. Is there a good use for that? Time to take the fast way. But if I fight a level 40 enemy and I'm level 80, I'll get like three or four points. I won't get like what they normally would get me. Fucking go, man. I am splitting like a motherfucker in here with the expiration. I love it. The level of the game is like open enough to allow me to do this. Most games are not. They'd rather spend their time telling you what you can't do, not what you can. Smarts. Let's head back over. I'm guessing we go right in around and we'll be in a good place. Could that be a path? Quite a rare sight. Ugh, it just spat something hey, out. That looks like a way forward. Huh. All right, our next uh, cutscene here. Bacchanus? It really looks like Bacchanus. How is that about? Okay, that wasn't the side press I was doing for Juniper, no. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. Kevez and Agnes are both fully mobilized. We'll have to pick them off one at a time. Is there a good use for that? You can never go wrong with some ether. Sliding down! 
We found rain. Yes, tracks. No, the cutscene is going to interrupt my story quest. Or my side quest, I should say. the arrest site. Right I'm here. curious to see what tactics you have in place surrounded by so much nature. One to kill What say monster. we go hunting together? <laughs> I'm fairly well versed in that. Oh, <gasps> come on. You guys are being a dickhead. <laughs> Let's make the most of our break, guys. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff to do here. Much better. Cook. Class point boost, so I'm trying to level these classes as quick as I can. I'm feeling energized already. Good, I can craft if I have any of the court gems now. I doubt it because I haven't really been farming. Honestly, don't even know where to go for most of these. I just been kind of grabbing stuff as I pass it. Sure, most of these are in the beginner zone still. So, okay, I gotta have some level ups. Level 50. I definitely feel stronger. Getting there. Save it. We're gonna get a big cutscene. It's good to keep a record. It's good to keep a record. <sighs> Wait, something when you have the rest. Saw you stuffing your cheeks. The rations should have been divided equally. Manana walked more than you used to today. Tommy was rumbly grumbly. Not much we can do though. Not now. Manana, look, we've still got a ways to go. So you're gonna have to get used to rationing stuff out, okay? Yeah, Manana. Show up, bruh. You know, lands. It's just... Is that robot gonna show up here? Fuck with us? Bunch of Ewoks. Come 
completely gone! <gasps> What's up? What's wrong? What did you say was gone? I think she was yelling about food. What? No way! For real! French sure did not just put elsewhere and forget. Nuh uh. I'm positive it was right here. Indeed. I checked it myself before I turned in. Don't tell me someone scoffed the whole lot. Ah, oh, no way. Plate unpolished. That awful, false accusation! Not even Manana ever stooped to such crude, vulgar behavior. All right, all right, we get it. Just chill out already. Manana refused to become frosty. This now matter of honor and dignity. For starters. I know Manana was feeling a bit peckish, but she can't have eaten up the lot. So who then? Art of restraint. Hey, check it. Banana do not. A feather? But what kind? I found tracks here. Nobody's blaming you here. These footprints. I think they're turkey. Mystery solved then. A turkey feather. So they raided our supplies. Lands can stop. Apology. Honor and dignity of banana left in tatters for a vile and baseless accusation. Come on, please, lighten up already. All accusations aside, we're really strapped for food. Guess we'll have to go foraging. I concur. Luckily, this area is pretty bountiful all in all, so we might not be too hard-pressed. Well, better get to it. Right. Okay. Anyway, that clearly too much eat. Manana is bottomless pit. Mehmet? Riku know Manana is dainty eater. Not denying. Lies and deceit. On this day of days, Manana will have retribution! <laughs> Looks like we've got ourselves a runner. Slipped out from the castle. Is this okay? He could get in touch with Ouroboros. Won't that impact our previous arrangements? Not to worry. If he does make contact, they'll come. <laughs> really? Ouroboros are simply like that. Hmm. Well, if you say so, we can probably take your word. Right, O? Hmm, certainly. As you say, P, we probably can take his word. Get our ship back. Uh, but first, guess we know what's on the menu today. Then we have a more pressing side quest. To... <sighs> you guys are being there assholes. There wasn't any food here, was there? Ooh, and actually, uh, now that I'm looking at the time, I think I am going to call it here. Uh, once again, thank you everyone for hanging out and subbing. Thank you, uh, Celtic Kennedy. Murphy, thank you for the bits. 
Blaze, thank you for your sub. Uh, I appreciate everyone hanging out, being cool, being chill. Uh, it means a lot to me. I don't get to stream that often or make content for YouTube. Everyone out there on YouTube is watching this and is hearing this message right here. Much love to y'all. Leave the like, comment, subscribe. Um, I don't want to hear what everyone else's thoughts on the game are. So far, I'm absolutely loving it. It is very light on Zeno callbacks, however, outside of like stuff that if you know, you know type of things. But in terms of like overt storytelling, linking all the games together, this game certainly has less of that than the other ones have by a lot. So I'm wondering if it's in here and it's just stuffed in the back half of the game. Uh, that's kind of my thoughts. I uh, appreciate everyone hanging out. Like I said, have a good evening and be safe, everybody. Peace.